The month of October delivers some of the most memorable views and fall colors in the Great Smoky Mountains National Park, but rangers also say it marks the busiest month for search and rescue teams. Tennis reporter Grace King joins us to explain why. Grace. John, October is that time of year where the temperatures get colder and the days get shorter. The park says those changes can catch visitors off guard. As our visitation increases, we certainly have more calls for service for EMS or search and rescue needs. In the Great Smoky Mountains National Park, visitors are keeping rangers busy. We have a lot of people wanting to come up here, enjoy the beautiful leaves, but they also get into trouble while they're here. The Tennessee National Guard says it's made seven rescue trips to the Smokies this year, including one last weekend. It took us a little longer than normal this time because um, the canopy was so thick over there. There's a lot of pine trees. So the leaves hadn't fallen off of them yet, and it was really steep. Once their medic found the injured hiker, they treated them on the ground, hoisted them up into the medevac, and brought them to UT Medical Center. Mount Lacant area is where we where we did the, the most recent rescue, and then the rescue I did right before that was also the Mount Lacant um, area. With so many people coming to the Smokies, emergency manager Liz Hall says they're teaching people how to avoid these types of situations. We encourage people to be smoky smart. So we want you to stay hydrated while you're in the park. Uh, map your hike, so understand the length of your hike as well as the topography. Always wear proper footwear, which in the fall time really means to wear a proper boot. We also want to make sure that you're wearing good layers as well. So layered clothing is always a great choice. Make sure it's not cotton. And if you're hiking this fall, the park says those layers will help you prevent getting cold in those chilly temperatures, especially up in those higher elevations. It's also a good idea to bring a headlamp or flashlight because the sun sets earlier. John. Those National Guard teams, a great security blanket. Thank you, Grace King, for that reporting. We moved.